On guard, ready, pass. Fencing is uh, essentially fighting with swords. Um, there's three weapons, there's foil, epée and sabre. Um, sabre is the kind of the cutting weapon that you hit with the side of the blade. Uh, epée, uh, you hit with the point, um, the whole body's the target. And uh, foil is also a point weapon that you can only hit on the, uh, on the torso. In epée, every time you score a hit, it's a point, apart from the last point where you need to score an outright winner. Um, and in foil and sabre, you score a point based on right of way. So if you're the one attacking, you get the point, and it's the first one to 15. If you're attacking in foil, uh, you're moving forward, uh, threatening the target area. And the only way you can take away someone's priority is by either parrying or making them fall short in their attack. Uh, and then you can take over the priority. You need to be fit, you need to be agile, you need to have good stamina. But more than anything, I think you, you kind of need to be quite analytical and quite kind of uh, reflective in in how you fence. It's a sport where you really need to work to kind of discipline your body to do the right movements. A lot of them don't kind of come naturally, especially the lunging or learning when you've got priority when it's right to attack. So you need to be someone that's willing to spend the time working out what you're doing wrong. Um, kind of natural ability would only take you so far. The best thing about fencing for me is the people that I've met. So in London you tend to get people from all over the world coming. Um, you get a really kind of diverse group of people. It doesn't tend to attract the people you'd think it would, so it's not like an old boys network. You really get people from all walks of life and all ages. It tends to attract people um, who have that same kind of mindset, so you, um, you tend to meet interesting people. It makes you really, really fit, um, and your heart really starts pounding. It's quite difficult to learn, but um, ultimately quite kind of rewarding. Uh, when you start winning bouts, and when you start getting your attacks on target, then it's really satisfying.